Sneakers for meat, school books for rice, a watch to heat a home for another day. This is Iran, where empty pockets and high inflation leave many with no choice but to exchange what little they have just to survive. But Iran has oil, and a lot of it, right? So where does all that money go? Dictators spend wealth on a violent and unstable world. This is how they stay in power, by corrupting. But their missiles don't speak the language of a new generation who are willing to give their lives for freedom. So what do they do? They build jails, and a lot of them and they fill them up with the future. And every morning, when the call to prayer comes, their hearts begin to race because they want to know who is next to be executed and what will they even be charged with? Corruption on Earth. Corruption on Earth. <laughs> How, like... <laughs> That's the obscure religious term that the mullahs are manipulating to crush freedom fighters. And while they're setting our world on fire, they execute our kids just for setting a garbage can on fire. This is exactly how dictators corrupt nations. But now they've never been more afraid. Schoolgirls are rising, warriors are fighting back, and a new Iran is coming. And they know it. <laughs>